all those likes and comments on social media, all the daring stunts just to get a fantastic shot or a selfie. It has to be better than your colleagues and it has to have more likes than them. Well, no, it doesn't. So what if your post, your photo or your comment only got one like? That means there is one person who connected to what you wrote. Isn't that great? Somebody liked what you did. It doesn't matter if it was your best friend or your mum or a stranger online. Somebody gave their time to you. And that's special. Appreciate it and be grateful for it. Many posts are created just to provoke feelings in us. They're not all real life. It's only for show. And even if it isn't, and these people are at the height of their success and enjoying their lives, be happy for them and wish them well. Be inspired by them. Don't have jealousy in your heart. That only damages you and hurts you. That prevents you from having what you want. Are you sure you want fame? Are you sure you want to be famous? It seems to me that it's not all it's cracked up to be. It's just an illusion. It's not real. Do you really want cameras clicking and flashlights popping all around you? If you do, then why is that? You know that many famous people are miserable, right? They have all the fame and fortune that goes with it, but they're not happy within themselves. Many people think the grass is greener and strive for fame. And yet when they get there, they realize it's not all it's cracked up to be. History has shown us that many famous people can't handle the pressure of being in the spotlight. When they reach the pinnacle of success, they try and continue and push for more. They want to better their own achievements and outdo themselves. Their success has become an addiction one that they'll do anything for to remain in the spotlight and to remain famous, even though they're damaging themselves. Being ambitious is a good thing, but not to the extent that it costs you your own health, both mentally, physically and spiritually. Many famous people develop addictions. They turn to hard substances, alcohol, food, gambling, and other things to cope with the pressure of being famous. As they age, some go through many painful operations to make themselves appear to be younger, so they can continue with their careers and remain relevant, even though this is completely changing them. They're changing their natural beauty. It's just another form of addiction, since it seems that some start and they don't know when to stop. Some of them are so famous that they can't walk down the street and go shopping like the rest of us. They long to do the little everyday things that we all take for granted, but they can't. Some try to disguise themselves, so they blend in, so nobody will know who they are whilst they're out and about. Others need to have security to follow them, guard them and make sure they're safe, since some get death threats while others purposely stage some drama to make the headlines so they're constantly in the public eye. What a toll on mental health that must be. What a way to live your life. It can be of no wonder that many celebrities choose to keep their children and loved ones out of the spotlight. They protect them from what they know to be damaging, and some even cover their children's faces so they can't be seen. Some have even paid the ultimate price for their fame and fortune and chosen to end it of their own accord. Is that really what you want? Do you want that for your friends and family? For those celebrities that have enough and can afford nice things and go to nice places, please don't show off just for the sake of it. Please be humble and appreciate what you have. Maybe use your knowledge and success to encourage and help people, not to make them feel inferior and unsuccessful. Perhaps TV shows like Look At Me, I Consider Myself a Celebrity could stop paying their contestants for these shows. Each contestant could be doing the show for a charity and the public could vote for which charity they wanted to win. The celebrity will prove themselves to be worthy of their fame by doing great charity work. The public would still have the show, 
be able to vote and perhaps enjoy even more knowing that they're paying their part in helping charities. The network putting out the show wouldn't lose anything since they'd be paying the money out anyway to the contestants previously and they might even gain more viewers. It seems like a win-win situation to me, but that's just me and we're all different. If you have decided that fame is what you want, then that's your decision. But please think carefully. Make sure it really is what you want.